This is Flora's song in C minor. Artist Lara Sermon interpreted the DNA of two weeds and made music out of it. It's meaning of yeah, science and music and art because I think um, all of that revolves, all of that, um, you need to be curious to learn and to experience. Sermon is a photographer foremost, and plants are her subjects. She brainstormed with geneticist Scott Pownall, who taught her how to sequence the DNA of two plants, the creeping buttercup and brown knatweed. Science is complicated, but if you break science down into small uh, parts um, uh, and do it in a way that's in engaging and, and evokes curiosity, then I think more people come on board. DNA comes down to four nucleotides, or bases, known as A, G, C, and T. Sermon translated those letters into musical chords. Each chord was given four notes. So whenever um, the letter um, in the DNA pops up, it tells me what note to play and how long that note should be held for. The notes merge together into a song, which is played on a pipe glockenspiel within a handmade music box, a throwback to the time of analog. It's the best sounding DNA that I've ever heard. <laughs> what is the primer specifically? Their curiosity merged on this project. Now these creative minds are thinking about cranking out more tunes with other species in the name of art and science. Robin Gill, Global News, Vancouver.